Oh, yeah. I was looking at it, thinking when we were in the lifeboat, because we were in the lifeboat for nine hours. Well, first of all, I have to say we're really excited about being here. Um, for me, it's extremely special. This is my hometown. Um, it, it's always a really important place, and to be able to bring, you know, something that's important to you back to this place, for me, it's heaven. And, of course, the dancers, they're ecstatic about being here. Um, yeah, so we're going to show Heroes, which is a piece about, about actually the five dancers. Um, it's sort of biographies, um, and we've used the music of David Bowie, because David Bowie, you know, he was also um, a man who changed and, and created many, many fashions, many many ways in, in the fashion and music industry. Um, and all of these dancers have had a, a difficult way to be able to make their career. And so we play with their stories. Some of them are quite touching. Some of them are really funny. <laughs> um, and sometimes you're wondering what is truth and what is not. But it's, it's certainly, it, it really takes your heart and you will find yourself smiling and probably laughing quite a bit. Um, the other piece is The Last Lifeboat. It's brand new. It's still, in a way, incomplete, although it, it's kind of growing. It started as a solo, now it's a duet. And it's the story of my grandaunt, Kate Gilner, who literally got the last place on the last lifeboat um, for, on the Titanic. And it was all thanks to James Farrell, um, who basically, he saved her life. And uh, she, she spoke in interviews about how it was and she always referred to him as her guardian angel. And um, so you'll see this, this story put into a duet. Um, you'll hear the voice of my granddad talking, telling like when she was 60. She was 16 when it happened, and she was 60 when she did this interview. And it's quite amazing. Like She really had, at first, no idea that the ship was going down until naturally she gets on the lifeboat and then realizes there are people in the water and it was just devastating and she talks about the sound of the boilers exploding but you hear all this with her her own voice speaking and we work with a sort of electronic uh, soundtrack and then the two dancers and they look very <laughs> very beautiful one is Puerto Ri from Puerto Rico the other is Italian but they both say they're totally Irish at heart so I think um, they really portray these two amazing people really well and I'm I'm really happy and it, I mean, huge significance for people of Longford. Not only do we have you here, internationally renowned choreographer, coming home with these, look, the world premiere of the showing of the last live boat, and also the Irish premiere of Heroes. But both um, Catherine and James Farrell are from Longford. Yes, from they are. They're from Cologne. Yeah, it would be great to meet James Farrell's family or anybody like that knew him, because really we have him to thank. Well, we were on standing on the steerage, third class they call it, and um, then we couldn't get up to second. And of course then there was one man with us and he was our guardian angel and he said for God's sake let the women up. From, from your point of view, to have this showing in Longford, I mean how significant is this for you? You've, you've worked all over the world, Bolshoi Ballet, um, what is the significance of bringing this home? Actually, you know, I would say two of the biggest highlights for me is Bolshoi and backstage. So they're, they, they're standing side by side. It's of course really, really special for me to be able to bring back, um, to just give and share uh, what I've done in my life. And so it's, it's major for me. It's really, really, really special. Well, we're absolutely thrilled to have you and can't wait for this Friday and Saturday. Thanks so <laughs> Thank much. Thank you.